Hello. Welcome to ignani.com. Microsoft Excel 2010. We, at ignani.com, have pooled the knowledge of a number of people in preparing this tutorial. Our goal is to share with you, what we have learnt about Excel, and in the process, help you be more efficient in using Microsoft Excel 2010. You may be new to this vast world of columns and rows that an Excel spreadsheet is made up of, or you may have worked with previous versions of Microsoft Excel, and might be looking for getting up to speed with the new version, or you may have some questions, for which you are looking for answers. This tutorial is designed for all, be it a beginner, intermediate or an advanced user. It covers all the essentials of Excel, from basic, to advanced topics, with practical examples that we have been using, so that it should be easy for you to adapt them as per your needs. We have tried to provide a lot of tips and tricks, that we have learned over all the years that we have spent in learning and using Excel. We have tried to cover everything you need, to get up to speed in Excel quickly and be productive in the shortest possible time. By the end of this tutorial, you should be able to work on Excel projects with confidence, and complete your projects efficiently and accurately the way it needs to be done. Let's get started in learning Microsoft Excel 2010. Chapter 1 Getting Started with Excel 2010 Part A Introducing Excel 2010 Excel is Microsoft's premier spreadsheet software, and is part of the Microsoft Office suite. It is the world's most widely used spreadsheet program. Even though we have other spreadsheet programs, Excel is by far the most popular and has become the world standard. It's good to know a little bit of history about Excel. Excel 2010 does not mean that it's the 2010th version. though. This is actually Excel version 14, but to be precise, Excel 2010 is the 11th release of Excel for Windows. In fact the first version of Excel was only for Macintosh machines. And they did not release Excel version 6, since Microsoft felt that the changes that they made were so much that it would be appropriate to jump two version numbers. They did not release Excel version 13 being a bit superstitious of number 13 being a bad luck number. Since Microsoft names some of their software with the year as a suffix, we are here with Excel 2010. What can you do with Excel? Though, Excel's strength is in performing numerical calculations, it is also very useful for non-numeric applications. The things that you can do with Excel are not small enough to list them all. But, I have tried to cover a few of them below. Managing and Analyzing Data You can create financial statements, marketing plans, sales report, expense reports, and perform just about any type of analysis you can think of, very easily. It simply brings down a lot of effort that you would otherwise require and allows you to concentrate your time on other work. Creating Charts You can create a wide variety of highly customizable charts, or with just a few clicks. Creating Graphical Dashboards Excel makes it very easy to create graphical dashboards, which summarize a large amount of business information in a brief format, to present your analysis in a simple but efficient way. Organizing lists. You can use Excel's grid layout to store lists professionally. Importing data. It's always difficult and not the efficient means to enter all the data from other sources. Excel makes this task very simple by providing options to import data from a wide variety of sources. Automating complex tasks. You can make tedious monotonous tasks as simple as a single mouse click, with Excel's macro capabilities. Programming with VBA 
If what you want to achieve is beyond the reach of the above list, you can always use VBA short for Visual Basic for applications, the programming language built into Excel, and other applications in the Microsoft Office suite. In our next video, I will introduce you to Excel 2010's user interface. If you have any questions or need more information on any part of this video, please use the forum at ignani.com, we will be happy to help you. You can find, a lot of free video tutorials, training materials, how to videos, and much much more at our site www.ignani.com. Use our forum topic related to this tutorial to get answers to all your questions. We would want your learning process as interactive as possible. Feel free to contact us.